Hi, uh, I'm James Wen, and I'll be talking about uh, Kubernetes jobs and the problems that occur when you run them with uh, <coughs> sidecars. So quick, quick introductions, I'm currently an SRE at Spotify, and I worked on the Kubernetes migration there. Uh, Spotify is a popular music and podcast streaming and discovery platform, and how we currently use Kubernetes is that we're in the process of migrating all of our stateless backend services and a lot of the related automation around that <coughs> over from Helios, our in-house orchestration, container orchestration system, over to Kubernetes, or specifically uh, GKE. And this talk is about the job resource in Kubernetes, which is part of the batch processing API and can be thought of as another orchestration layer around uh, pod resources. They've been in Kubernetes for over four and a half years, and there's a large GitHub issue titled Better Support for Sidecar Containers and Batch Jobs that has been around for three years, over three years now. And so the problems, problems manifest when you run uh, this kind of setup, where for your job pods, you have a main job container, uh, but you also have sidecar containers, uh, either one or multiple that your main job container uses or communicates, relies on in some fashion. Uh, so this setup is becoming more and more popular, especially with things like Istio uh, becoming more popular that also uses Paradigm. And so with this setup, there are actually many issues uh, and problems caused by the lack of like, first class support for sidecar containers. Uh, but this one is the most visible one and the one that definitely requires like, a workaround of some kind. <coughs> and it's where your main job container uh, for your job, com uh, job pod will complete. But your sidecar container, uh, which is usually like a long running process of some kind, uh, will keep running. And so in Kubernetes, uh, pods will not be marked as complete until all containers of the pod are also complete. And so you end up with uh, job pods and accordingly jobs that never complete. So we noticed this at Spotify uh, because uh, we heavily use sidecars for the purpose of metrics. Uh, on each VM at Spotify, there's a metrics relay called Fast Forward that's listening on port 19,000 for metrics, basically just gets metrics via UDP, sends them off to uh, our, the rest of the metrics system. We forklifted this into our Kubernetes setup by basically uh, injecting this metrics relay as a sidecar container for all pods. Uh, we did this so that uh, developers, when migrating to Kubernetes, were able to migrate their workloads without any code changes uh, for how they send metrics. There's always going to be something listening on port 19,000 uh, for metrics. And so when we did this with jobs uh, that require the emission of metrics, we ran into this problem, where the main job container uh, completes, but the uh, metrics relay sidecar container uh, keeps running. And so our job pods and our jobs wouldn't complete. And so in that issue, there are a variety of workarounds. The one that we're currently using is the most popular one uh, from that issue, and it involves uh, shared volume communication. <clears throat> so basically what this entails is that your main job container and your sidecar container uh, mount a shared volume, and the main job container on completion will basically write a file to that shared volume. And then your sidecar container is constantly uh, looking for the existence of that file. And when it sees it, uh, sees that it exists, it knows that the main job container has completed and that it itself uh, should also complete. And so if you're thinking that that's kind of hacky, ugly, uh, you're right. It's n definitely not a sustainable workaround. Um, there's a lot of other problems with it. Uh, but luckily, uh, Joseph Irving created a Kubernetes enhancement proposal uh, describing a first-class API for sidecar containers uh, for Kubernetes, both for like job and batch processing workloads, batch processing workloads, but also for like deployments and microservices. Uh, however, jobs have been out for about four and a half years. Uh, that large GitHub issue has been uh, out for about three years, and the cap has been out for about a year already. Uh, so let's get some more feedback in motion on that cap. Uh, you can test out their proof of concept, and this is important because jobs have been GA. Uh, for quite some time, and cron jobs are about to become GA soon. Uh, so if you care at all about sidecar containers, uh, jobs, or batch processing, uh, please take a look at the cap, give some feedback. Thanks for listening. <laughs>